everybody welcome back to my channel my name is Fumi Desaluvul for those of you that are stopping by for the very first time I'm a wife I'm a mother I'm a model actress motivational speaker but above all else I am what I am a makeup addict and that is why you are what that is why you are here <laughs> Welcome darlings, welcome. Today is rather exciting my darlings. Why? Because we are going to review, we are going to have swatches of the Jaclyn Hill Times Morphe Palette Volume 2. Yes, darlings. Thank you, Jacqueline, for this gorgeous PR package as well as Morphe. It is absolutely divine. I was struggling. I was going back and forth. Should I do the um, Academy Awards red carpet? And I can tell you, Jacqueline, you are the most colorful, most vibrant person so far. You should have been on the red carpet because there was nobody that was just giving me life. Vanity Fair was fabulous, but the red carpet was like, eh, blah. So, Jacqueline, thank you for this burst of purple right here. Shall we open up, my darlings? Let us open up. So it opens up this way. Hello. Look at Jacqueline right here. This is absolutely gorgeous. This work was done by the one and only Lipstick Nick. She is amazing. She's a makeup artist, but she does a lot of these campaigns for other MUAs that have their brands, and this is simply divine. We go on to this side right here. Swing it wide open, and we have Fuchsia and that burst of sunshine yellow and right here smack in the middle let me just make sure that you guys can see it yep we have morphe jacqueline hill and this is the palette volume two so let's pick that out voila we got a card right here it has a couple of details if i can get it yep and let's close this up this is all for your benefit by the way because i've already used it as you can see and then this is the back of it as well so let's put that to the side so before we go on let us read the card and it says i hope these vivid shades make you feel strong powerful loved the way you make me feel every day exo jacqueline hill the palette retails for 39 dollars it's in the morphe store as well as morphe online don't forget to use jacqueline's discount code jack attack capital letters jacqueline hill palette volume two does that mean there's a volume three four five six seven eight nine ten <laughs> Alrighty, let us open the hood. Voila. Let me take this film off. Oh, it says here, to all of my loving subscribers who have supported me all these years, this one is for you. Exo Jacqueline. And there you go, darlings. Let me bring it a little closer. These are all of the shades. Bada bing. Let me pull back a little bit and let's talk about the palette and talk about Jacqueline a little bit before we dive in with swatches and then the makeup tutorial. Jacqueline had said that this palette was in the works since 2018. She had done the first palette. Let me just open that up for you right here. There you go. The first palette and she had said to herself I don't know if I can do better than this I don't know if I can do better than this and uh, she had come to the conclusion that it should be bursts of color it should be much more punchy much brighter it was two years in the making <laughs> which swatches down both their arms Linda's and hers in order to try to get this palette now as she had said some people had asked why is she doing another collaboration with Morphe when she already has her own brand and I was like uh, that the, the question itself didn't make sense because I was like why are they asking Jacqueline this I say this why because Jacqueline is to Morphe the way Amrizi is to ABH the way I love Sahari is to Colourpop the way I am to Juvia's Place no matter where I go in life and of course I hope to have my brand one day I will always collab with Juvia's Place they gave me that first love we get on like a house on fire why wouldn't I collaborate with them over and over and over again having said that brands collaborate with each other all the time that is pure fact, my darlings. You've got Giampatistia Valley collaborating with H&M. You've got this brand collaborating with another brand. That is the point, to come together with creative minds and bring out something that's almost once in a lifetime thing. That's the way I look at it. So as far as I'm concerned, Jacqueline, have your brand, but always collaborate with Morphe. On top of which she said that she was not in that place or space where it came to knowledge, where it came to finance, to come out with a palette 
35 shades for only $39. Morphe is the one that can do that for her, that can bring her creativity to life. And I completely and absolutely understand that. So having said that, Jacqueline, congratulations. Enough of chit chat. Let us get into the swatches. Now I'm going to go row by row and I have swatched them in the sun for you guys, because I really wanted you to see how these looked and their names and everything. And we're going to go through all of them for you. So without a beat, let us start. Oh, 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 some of you are already asking me, Fumi, I love your look, I love your hair. Darlings, this is a wig. <laughs> this is a wig. When I get tired with my hair, I just plop it on. And you know, for me, I don't like that wig where you have to play and make edges or whatever. It just doesn't work for me. I try to keep my real edges in front. And so you put the wig on and then you just put a little bit of your hair in front and style your hair and the wig together. And I just love this. The blouse, again, is from Zara. <laughs> Zara should give me PR. <laughs> the amount of Ula's money I spent in that store. <laughs> Alrighty, let's go into swatches. So the first one is a white shade right here. This is the white shade and it is called Certified. Again, Lipstick Nick had said, you know what, Jacqueline, I love, I love this palette so very much. But her white shades were shimmers and she wanted a matte white. So she went ahead and created a matte white in honor of Lipstick Nick. Like I told you, Lipstick Nick is a guru and Lipstick Nick found herself always looking for that like white matte shade. The next shade that we have over here, my darlings, is called I'm In It. I'm In It is in honor of her friend who always says I'm In It. It's an inside joke and that's an iridescent uh, purplish pink. It looks white but it comes out and that's what I have in the tear ducts right here. The third one of course is called Love Hunters. Girl, I have them. As a matter of fact, I've been working hard. I'm feeling very fabulous. I gained 20 pounds after Adrian. <laughs> And I'm still trying to lose it. And I have one little love handle right here that just won't go. But Ula loves it. Ula's like, girl, I love you. I like you thick. I don't. I don't. I want to fit in my clothes. I want to be fabulous. I want to give all of you heart attacks on my Instagram page. <laughs> <laughs> These here are transition shades. She has three different types of transition shades here. And this one is called Comfort Zone. And, and it's a nice neutral for the girls, especially this top row, for those girls that are not really adventurous like my very good self when it comes to color. The other one right beside it is also called Perfectionist. And these are mattes. She has shimmers, she has mattes, she has glitters, as well as satins. And I will tell you as we go on with the colors. The first glitter is called Called ride or diamonds ride or diamonds and you can use your finger and you can just tap it over or you can put a little bit of glitter glue and that baby will pop fire oh to die all right then the last one on the first row number seven is called thick skin we all need it I tell you I developed thick skin over time experience and age i just developed a thicker skin to the point that you know if i get hate if i get negativity i laugh because i realize it's not got anything to do with moi it's got everything to do with you because i'm still fabulous second row we have what you call no joke well 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 hello that is a bright yellow she had also another yellow inside her first palette and you can see the difference the darker yellow is more custody whereas the new yellow in the volume 2 palette is more neon neon baby give it to me bright see me when i'm coming for those in the back <laughs> all right and then we have talia talia is named after her niece her wonderful niece who loves gold apparently her bedroom is black and gold talia picked this color and she named it after talia then we have feeling myself this orange is everything i have it right there in my transition shade and it is beautiful it's a true true orange next to which we have homebody one of Jacqueline's favorites as a matter of fact she says that she just uses this around her eye over above under pops on some lashes and she's good to go then we have three glitters right here and they're of like different shades but still in the same family and they are called get ready with me g-r-w-m as in mother bougie bougie and drama queen and these are gorgeous you've got the gold you've got like a pinky you've got like a rose gold you really beautiful glitters and they have slightly different hues which i can as sarah love yes my darlings all right now we go into a satin and this is gorgeous this is like an orangey goldy flawed and odd 
love it next to it is a beautiful brown and this is called g money this is uh, named after one of her dogs who was called george georgie money g money so she named that after him he's adorable now we have two corals we have a pinky coral we have an orange coral and this color is called positivity as in positivity T, as in T-E-A-T. -E now, this was a little bit controversial because uh, Shane Dawson, Jeffree Star, had come out with a controversial, uh, no, was it controversial palette? I've forgotten. Co conspiracy, conspiracy, conspiracy palette. And one of the names for the shades was called Reality, also Reality. TEA. Some of the Jeffree Star's fans and Shane Dawson's fans had accused Jacqueline of copying. But this was in production from two years ago. And that's the thing with creativity, you know. That's why you have the phrase called creative minds think alike. It is pure coincidence, my darlings. Moving on, moving on, we have my man. And that is the orangey coral absolutely gorgeous 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 and then next to it we have grateful we should always always be grateful more so for me because when kobe passed away with his daughter as well as seven other victims in that helicopter it was such a shock to my system that you can walk out the door on a normal day you have plans in the evenings you have things you're going to do with your family next week and it can change and it can change and I'm so, so, so grateful and I get scared because I have Ula, I have Adrian and I just couldn't imagine. So, you know, this, this hit hard, you know, for me. While we're talking about names, I am so happy that Jacqueline had the names in this palette printed into the palette as opposed to her first because this one didn't have the names. This had a card and that was wonderful but it's nothing as easy as being able to recite the names for you remember the names because it's right underneath the shade then the next shade is a lovely lovely punchy raspberry pink and that is called heart on heart on then living my best life i did not know that jacqueline was going to send me pr I promise you I did not. She had sent me PR from her own brand, but I didn't know that I'll get one from uh, Morphe. And I tell you, when I saw this, when she launched it, I was going to buy it with Ula's coin <laughs> when I saw this red. When I saw this true red, because you know how much I love red, and I have it right there because, you know, that's just me. I'm addicted. <laughs> what can I tell you? It's my life. <laughs> This red is a true red and it's very, very, very difficult to create. And I tell you this because I have a true red in my palette. And we know how many times we went back and forth trying to get that shade. All right, moving further down, we have a moment. And this is a nice shimmer purple. Right after living my best, this is my favorite, favorite shade. And that is called Therapy Sesh. And I have it on my lid. Oh my God. Woo! Beautiful. It's alive. It's vivid. Gives me that lilac vibes. Everything. Right beside it is called Lolly Mama. Lolly Mama again is one of her dogs. And this is a beautiful, beautiful pink. Right beside it we have Tipsy Girl. And this is a neon pink. Neon in the same family as the yellow called No Joke. Everything. Then we have a glitter. And this is beautiful, empowered. Let us be empowered. Let us empower each other. Let us lift each other. Let us always try to give energy because when you give that energy, you get it back tenfold. Right beside it, you have NYX. That was one of my transition shades. It just, ah, oh, it just brought the look together, as you can see. The last one on this one is called Dance Party. Oh, and that is like a fuchsia deep pink jacqueline loves to dance jacqueline loves a party who doesn't love a party as a matter of fact i don't know whether i've mentioned it before but i'll say it again i was in new york i was on my way back to london after having stayed in la for about three months and jacqueline has sent me a text and said for me i would love for you to come to my halloween party and it was so unfortunate because i was already on the east coast but i have promised her that if she has another one i will definitely show up who doesn't love a great party 
all right we're going to the bottom and this one is called stay true being true to yourself is your power then we have not my journey my darlings when i tell you this is one of the best purples ever i have a purple in my palette and this is just as good then we have a beautiful shimmer right here good place and that is what life is this is your journey until you get to a good place and it's like driving you get to a good place you get to a good speed and then you cruise then we have palo palo is named after her assistant's alter ego her assistant who is a guy anything that goes wrong he blames it on palo <laughs> palo misplaced jacqueline's watch for two weeks <laughs> Palo drinks. Palo doesn't know how to drive or is a bad driver. I forget. But I have multiple personalities too. So I got it and I thought it was fabulous. And then this is a very interesting shade. Really, really gorgeous. It has a shift to it and it's really sensational on the eyelids and also in the tear duct. We move swiftly to, oh, hello, another assistant. Might I say that Jacqueline has a good team around her because she seems to have her family around her, her assistants who really love and care for her. So of course, her other assistant anytime when her assistant sees her dogs her assistant goes oh hello oh hello <laughs> then we have crazy which is a deep plum oh that time of the month I don't even trust myself I'm a little bit crazy I'm a little bit you know off the edge and I react just once a month 12 times a year <laughs> yeah I know some of you are with me you get it and then the last but not the least is a beautiful black with a hint of glitter and this one is called temptress I loved I love Tati Westbrook's palette I reviewed it and I had said that the only thing the only thing that I wish she had had was a black glitter here come Jacqueline Hill giving me exactly what I wished and desired and my darlings those are the 35 sheets so without any further ado let us get into the tutorial sit back enjoy yourselves and we'll be back to have a little bit more of a comparison beside volume one and volume two and then we will find out if this puppy is fdv approved or not <laughs>
Sometimes I pinch myself, it could have been a dream This is my current mood, I always will remember You're nothing but yourself and that's why I believe That this could last for good cause we're so great too My darlings, do we love? Do we love? <laughs> I love. I adore. I got dressed for the occasion. It makes me happy when I tell you. I just feel as if, <coughs> for me, exactly what event are you going to? All right, so let's do a little comparison. I don't know whether you guys can see it, but volume one palette is a matte palette. Yes, the packaging and the volume two is a sheen. Other than that, the font is different, but it's the same size, it's the same color, it's the same MO. Yeah, all righty. Now, when you open it, that is, this is the volume two and this is the volume one. You can see that the volume one is much more tamed, whereas the volume two has so much punch. It just has so much color. It, it is so vivid. The volume two is very, very, very me. It's very bold. It's confident. It is absolutely beautiful. At the same time, I think both of them are gorgeous. There's a blue in the volume one that I live and die for, and there's that sea foam green at the bottom, which I also live for. In my humble opinion, I will always use these both. As you can see, this one is so beaten up. All right, darlings. I absolutely love this palette. It is <laughs> FDV approved. It is absolutely FDV approved. I wasn't ready. I didn't see this coming. I think that all of us have a gift. And I think that Jacqueline has a passion for makeup. But I also believe she has a God-given gift for makeup. There are two different things. And she has tapped into that gift. And luckily for her, that is her passion. Because you can be gifted at something. And when I say gifted, it comes easily to you. You don't really have to work hard for it. Uh, being a TV personality comes easily to me. Fashion comes easily to me. I see style and I get it and I understand it. I can break it all the way down. I don't know, I just see it that way. So it's so important to understand your God-given gift that comes easily to you and doesn't come that easily for others. That's a gift, do you see? Because it's special. On top of that, she has a passion because we're in 2020 and to have gotten all of these colors two years ago, it just blows my mind. It blows my mind because fashion, style, beauty constantly evolves and changes. So when you're doing things, you have to think ahead. The mats are gorgeous. The satins are beautiful. There's not a single shade in here that I don't love. There's not a single shade in here that I thought, oh no, I cannot use. And I was apprehensive because I was a little bit shaky about the transition. It was fine. It was absolutely perfect. For every eye look, you need a transition. A transition that can merge one color to the other seamlessly. If for those that don't understand. You also want to have like a little highlight in your tear duct because it's where you cry, your tears. You want to have something in your brow bone. That's why I put in the orange. And you want to have really rich colors. You want to have also a sheen. You want to have a satin. You want to have a matte. You want to have a glitter to create different looks. And she got this damn packed in this palette. Congratulations. As you noticed, I used Jacqueline Hill Mega Words Highlighter. Loved it. I used the Morphe Lip Gloss as well as Patrick Tara. Try to keep it Morphe-esque. And I used my pink blusher for my own palette. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, my darlings. Go out there. Enjoy this palette. Thank you, my darlings, so very much for watching. And I love you.